If you look at the group of top 16 players, you can see things in common. One of them is that they never lose energy. They can transfer all of the energy into the shot. Hello and welcome, this is Snooker Coach Brando. Welcome to another video. Have you ever heard of decelerating into the shot? Yes, of course. And this is a very bad thing. I'm not sure if you know what is to decelerate into the shot. Probably some of you know. But if you decelerate into the shot, you can miss. And of course, we don't like to miss. You can decelerate if you slow down the speed of the cue right before you hit the white ball. Or because of a bad grip. If your grip is not good enough, then you may not transfer all of the energy from the hand into the white ball. And then you may miss. When you're making your delivery, the cue travels with certain speed. That speed slows down dramatically when the cue impacts with the cue ball. The cue is almost 600 grams. The cue ball is 142 grams. So there are opposite forces which apply onto the cue when you're striking the white ball. If your grip is bad and if you're losing the energy, if you cannot transfer all of the energy from the hand into the white ball, then your shot is not positive enough. And if you lose that energy, you may decelerate into the shot, the cue can wobble in your grip, that loses accuracy as well. The top professional players have very good ring which surrounds the cue. Some of them make the ring with the thumb and the pointing finger and there is absolutely no gap nowhere in that ring. That allows them to transfer all of the energy from the hand and the cue into their shot. Some of the players are making the ring with their middle finger, and this is absolutely correct. Ronnie O'Sullivan, Jack Lisowski, Mark Williams, top 16 players are using that kind of grip. They make the ring with their middle finger. Jutram keeps his grip very loose. He has little gap, very little gap, here in that skin, but at the moment of impact, because he is using lots of wrist, that gap is closed, there is no gap, so he transfers the energy into the shot. Have a look at your grip, see if there is a gap in your ring and try to correct it. When we're talking about solid grip, we are not talking about tight grip. The grip should be loose, but check if there is gap into your ring. I can see some of you are not subscribed to the channel. Please do it. See you next time.